Artificial intelligence is taking over in 2023. From AI artists dropping music to doing students homework for them to even being on everyone's Snapchat, you can't avoid it. AI has an answer for basically anything you can ask it, but I had to put it to the test today. What did AI know about Call of Duty trickshotting? I asked the AI and it seemed to know the history and the basics, but now it was time for the real test. Would AI be able to watch and react to specific trick shots? I needed the answer to this question, so I asked my followers over on Twitter to send me their best recent trick shots. Let's see what the AI thinks of them. To start off we're on Vanguard and we have Goon jumping up and hitting an airborne 5 and 1 oh collateral, you oh can hear him freaking out in the background at how insane that was. Next up we have my good friend Parallel Recon and he's playing Steam Modern Warfare 2, he's gonna miss his first shot, but it's all good cause he's gonna hit a casual little 2 piece mid game on Karachi, not a bad shot, but the clip isn't over yet because he's gonna run back up top and see the enemy near the bomb and go for a clean 1080 glide over the top and get the headshot too. That was actually such a beautiful shot and you can hear his friends in voice chat waiting for the kill cam which was so damn clean, amazing clip recon. Next we're switching over to advanced warfare and we got Eco with a stupid clip, he's gonna get 4 singles with the Morse thermal jumping through the air and then go for the no scope ender for the 5th kill and absolutely slap some kid, that was just crazy. Now we're on the new modern warfare 2 and we got Box playing some hardcore search and destroy on embassy, he knows the enemy is going over to the bomb so he's gonna hop up on the railing and go for his cool little pistol combo and hit this crazy wall bang. That wall is so thick you can even get hit markers in hardcore so good thing he had the Victus, but yeah that over the shoulder was mad clean, good stuff Fox. We're on some Call of Duty Ghosts Extinction mode, now which you don't normally see trick shots on and in fact is gonna be hitting some crazy as a combo with what looks like some gun glitch and the Venomax and the SVU Marksman rifle. I don't even know what happened there, but there's a modded kill cam so we can see how sick it actually was, nice bill in fact. We're hopping back over to unset up Steam Modern Warfare 2 for this next clip hit by 2 blind, he does a Barrett shoot still swap to an M1014 oh oh barrel God. roll reload knack to oh an institute and slaps the sweaty nerd with his whole six man spectating it live, and once again you can hear his whole team and him reacting as they watch back this sick combo in the kill cam, that was beast man. So now we're on some black ops for which is a game you never see trick shotting on especially unset up like this clip, but phantom is such a goat he's gonna spot the guy top tower on nighttime firing range and tag him and then go for the wall bang like he's linksy with the sdm which is the weakest sniper in the game, the dark matter camel looks so nice as well. Unfortunately, this is BO4, so he didn't get kill cam only play of the game, but still a banger. Time for a Cold War clip. We got Sheboygan with the Tundra on Yamantau and he's gonna be behind these dudes getting a casual 6 on and then another kill after. They had no idea what hit them. We're staying on the next gen cods for this clip from NorCal Talents who's playing gunfight on the new Modern Warfare 2, which is a game mode where you have to trickshot with random guns like pistols. He gets flashed by the enemy but still hits a clean suicide shot with the deagle no problem. That was fire talons. Still on the new Modern Warfare 2 from this next clip from Lord Canis who's going to be doing the god mode glitch in private match to jump out of Voldera's museum onto the street and then go for this crazy under the map trickshot which he makes look easy cause he hits it no problem on unset up bots as well so it's even better than having a second console setting up. You can hear him and his friends freaking out about him being the first one to hit this shot so good stuff king. We're on another newer COD game, but this is actually some vanguard free for all trick shotting which is unset up obviously, Stella is on eagle's nest and is gonna go for the gun glitch suicide shot and absolutely poop on that randy bob trying to kill him and he's actually gonna get the kill cam as well which is extremely rare for this game since you normally get play of the game, I bet that kid was so humiliated watching that back, keep killing it Stella. We got a lot of stuff you don't see much anymore in this video because now we got some unset up Xbox One COD Ghosts DLC search and rescue trickshotting, Agile Wolf is gonna be on the favela remake hitting a double knack climb, shot trophy system silent shot wall bang on some greasy sweatball and the shot just looked really nice, you gotta love a good ghost's trick shot. Now we got Jack on some cold war and he's gonna run up and hit a quad collateral spawn snipe on Zoo which is an absolute banger when you consider he's mainly an editor and leader, that was so nice Jack. We're back on that gunfight game mode from earlier and I forgot to mention it was 2v2 which makes this clip even more insane, we got eye on foe and his teammate dies, but it's all good because he's gonna tag one of them, kill the other enemy and then hit a crazy two piece with the deagle across the map and as you can tell by his reaction this clip could not be more of a banger, foe is a monster at this new mw2 i swear, now i'm not much of a bo3 guy but i can tell you this one is insane in the membrane, versi is gonna do a wall run bounce weapon pickup, do some insta swaps and ipad cancels, and then shoot into heaven itself and somehow hit an absolute stinker on one of my deceased relatives, rest in peace to them by the way. But yeah I've honestly never really seen any Black Ops 3 bounces especially with a combo of this cool so good stuff mate. We got the first World War 2 shot of this video and it's from that British content creator guy Detso, he's gonna hit a gnarly little paratrooper combo.
combo across the map and why would he get killcam? Come on you know Call of Duty hates trickshotters. But you wanna know who is gonna get killcam? This beast Ion Select is with the sick gun glitch fade shot across farm 18 on the new MW2. Completely unset up as you can see by the kill feed because the enemy had just peeled his teammate like a banana but yeah the little reverse reload looking thing in the killcam could not have looked any nicer. That was a very steezy shot select keep it up. Now we got books on the new Modern Warfare 2 and he's playing hardcore SND on Breenberg Hotel. He's gonna take a second here trying to get this nasty gun glitch with the slide but as soon as he gets it he goes for the shot and hits through the thickest wall that I didn't even know was possible to wallbang but as you can tell from his reaction and the kill cam he really slapped that. Moving over to BO2 on the plutonium client we got Ankuf playing the VK servers with some custom camo on his ballistic knives and he's gonna do a little ballistic knife money whip out his hunter killer throw his tomahawk and hit a ballistic knife reload knack on some trick shutter who was in midair going for an attempt with some nice distance as well and the floater. You can tell he's hyped by the reaction and he should be hyped because that actually looked gorgeous if I'm keeping it a V-Buck. No Fortnite. We're back on the new Modern Warfare 2 for this next clip and we got my favorite trick shotter on the game Saki going from my favorite trick shot spot on the game which is the out of map spot on Embassy that you can get to doing the god mode glitch in private match. As you can see it has a zip line that he's gonna spin onto but not only that he's gonna spin again and then hit a momentum bounce all the way into the map, that was so clean and had so much distance that people are never gonna get how perfectly that had to be timed. Good thing I'm an AI so I can comprehend what a banger that was. Staying on the new MW2 we have shows on the new lighthouse map they just added this season cooking up a fire little NSL combo and slapping the trick shot unset up on that munch. You can see in the kill cam he did some inspects and equipment cancels and honestly it just looked heat. Good stuff man. I never thought I'd be saying this, but now we got another World War II trick shot. This one is a sick gun glitch suicide shot on Flak Tower SND from Winky with some insta swaps and W reactions. We absolutely love to see the game variety. Once again we are back on gunfight on the exhibit map with a clip from Blue. He got a different pistol this time, but the enemy's health is so low that he's able to one-shot him with a sick suicide shot from the very back of the map and even got the enemies reacting to the spill. What a heater. But speaking of heaters check out this clip from Hit Marks. He already has one kill up in the feed and he's gonna get another kill then climb up this ladder with two enemies left and go for the most random two-piece and wallbang headshot some dork. But unfortunately his teammates didn't get the defuse so no kill cam. What L teammates, but sick clip regardless. Now we got an as a shot, which I'm very familiar with since we're both done by computers after all so I can tell you that Joey did some type of bolt movement bolt knack can swap repeater gun glitch thing whipped out a magnum tack knife out of nowhere then AC4 remote Malamadere 2 piece bolt knack with a custom camo links on the ghosts favela remake once again, sick boopy by my fellow robot. Now back to something hit by a human, we got racer on crown raceway, how ironic, but he's gonna be going for this random wallbang in free for all with the silenced victus and slapping some CDL champ but unfortunately did not get final kill cam. We got a repeat offender because Books is back with another bill cam and this one just went dummy. He's gonna hit the museum suicide shot and wall bang it unset up on yet another CDL wannabe with the dual katanas with a clean fake shoot combo with the claymore and the do not use camo which is rare so you don't see a trick shot that's sick very often which is why this young man is just freaking out in the reaction. Books you are an animal man keep snapping. Okay that was sick, but now we have something crazy unique. We got Benjamils playing ghosts and he's on team deathmatch on siege which you just don't see clips on but he's gonna be running up on the ops with a silenced L115 and hitting a quad headshot feed on these absolute bots. You might think he's overreacting but go try to hit a clip like this yourself and you'll understand how insane that actually was. We're back on the new Modern Warfare 2 again for yet another unique clip. This one is once again on gunfight, but it's with an actual sniper this time even though it's a funky looking one with a red dot, but anyways Cautious is going to get a hit marker on his first shot, which was a little fist in spec with the cool skull gloves like he's a skull trooper or something, but this ain't no Fortnite so he's gonna go back up top to the other roof just a few attempts later and go for the same shot but even better, and since the guy was tagged from the first shot he's able to slap the clean little shot on him, his friend actually called out that would happen too after he hit markered it so you already know they're both hyped in voice chat. Next up we got days on cold war with the filthiest no scope only five on headshot with the pellington on showroom that was so quick goddamn now this one is a banger we got we'll see on the og modern warfare 2 on steam so it's unset up not on some ai like me and he's gonna be going for a sprint swap m10 14 barrel roll infinite fade insta shoot across the whole damn map and when we watch it back in the kill cam you'll see he actually got the jnac or freeze knack as well 
That actually was one of the best MW2 trick shots I've seen in a minute. We're staying on the OG Modern Warfare 2 for the shot, but we're gonna be on some IW4X with a banger from Nihilist. He's gonna go for a WA 2000 One Man Army Shacks Instant Tactical Insertion Plant. WA 2000 Weapon Pickup Smooth can swap off the terminal itself, and the shot just looks so smooth with the animations he did, and all his custom stuff looks so clean too. This man knows how to do it right. For the final clip, we're still gonna be on terminal, but on the new Modern Warfare 2 instead, with an absolutely insane 7 multi with the SAB on the ground. War version of this map from the back of Burger Town from Wiggy EJR. What an actual demonic clip. All right, I'm going to take things back over now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video concept. If you guys want to see me do this again with different voices, like maybe presidents or your favorite artists, make sure to drop a like on the video. 80% of you guys that watch my videos aren't subscribed, so please make sure to click that button if you haven't yet. Thanks for watching. Now check out my last video here if you haven't seen it yet. I think you guys will really enjoy it.